to do what to do what to do YouTube. It's your boy Lil Smack. And today we are back at it again with another banger, man. And I cannot wait to show y'all, man. I did just want to say before we get started, I appreciate y'all for the 500 subscribers, man. It means a lot, man. We are halfway there to a thousand subs, man. When we get to a thousand subs, trust me, I will have a big giveaway going on. So it's enough to eat for everybody, man. But on to the video, man. Today we got some shoes that everyone's been one, always will want. We'll talk about later towards the end. I want to restock will be happening. The Air Jordan 1 Lost and Founds, man. I got these in hand, got these in a size 8, and we will be doing a comparison video, man. So going around that box, man, you know you got that distressed old looking box, man. We've all seen this before going around the entire thing, man. Super, super, super crispy. Underneath, got that same distressed look, man. And let's just get right to the box, man. Underneath, there is a marking over here up top. This is a sponsored video, so I do want to give a quick shout out to them. 4Kick992, I'll put their information here and in the description down below. Use code SMACK for some money off, man. But back to the video, man. We got the Sandy receipt here. We will do a comparison to do it with the, uh, the replica and the real, so don't worry. We'll just get right to the shoes, though. We got that newspaper here. And go ahead and unbox the shoe, man. Go ahead and peep them out. Ooh-wee. Damn, man. Peep them things out. The Air Jordan 1 Lost and Founds, man. Looking so crispy. Ooh-wee. These are fire, man. Check these things out. y'all y'all see them the air jordan one lost and found looking crispy man looking solid looking clean man and to be honest man they really look really good there's not much really to go off of compared to the real pair um i got that in hand as well but first first glance man i don't see any imperfections nothing around the toe box nothing here nothing underneath everything looks good Got the two laces, no strong scent. These are pretty fire, man. Pretty, pretty fire. So let's go ahead and do a comparison against the real dealio here. So got the real pair here in a size 11 and a half. You know, it's gonna be the real dealio here. Going on the top of the lid to lid. They look pretty much the same, man. Pretty much the same. Got the same markings underneath. Taking a look at this receipt, you got the real pair on your left and the replica pair on your right. They do have a little bit more of a green border on the replica pair and it's a little bit more yellow on the replica pair as well. So that's a little indicator there, but not too shabby, not too shabby. Going off of the paper feel, I already can tell that the white paper off of here is much more thinner paper, much, much more thinner, more like a, like a wrapping paper, more like for gifts type of thing. Same thing with the newspaper, it's pretty much a little bit off. It doesn't feel the exact same. On the real pair, the newspaper is a little bit darker, the whole color of it, compared to the replica pair. So that's another thing to look out for. But other than that, that's pretty much the same there, same, same. And then going real to replica, we'll do the same shoe. So you got the real pair right here and the replica pair here, man. And going straight off of it, man, I don't really see any crazy imperfections or differences. The sides pretty much look the same. Can't lie on that. 
they got those pretty on par the back of the shoe here too pretty much looks the exact same if not very similar the color though of the tongue is something that is a little off so it's a little bit more pink on the replica pair compared to the real pair here if you can tell right there a little bit more pink there the heels are pretty much on par for this being a size 8 I do notice though on the toe box on the replica pair it does kind of slant more inside so if you can just tell by that that slant there might be able to see it toe to toe there though but it's more of a slant this one's more up so you can see how it's more up and on the toe box here it's a little bit more slanted about right there so there is that but other than that man going straight off of it it looks pretty much the same man they really got the color on 10 they got the swoosh pretty much on par nothing i could really tell man other than the tongue being a little bit pink and this toe box here being a little bit flatter nothing else the tumbled leather is pretty much the same as well nothing crazy to it yeah pretty much a good shoe i gotta give it to him on this one this one i can't really find any imperfections or differences the bottoms of the shoe, so you have a little bit less powder on the replica pair, which is on your left. A little less of that powder, that older look that they wanted to add. But that's nothing really crazy. Nothing really crazy at all, though. Other than that, I'll be honest, it looks pretty good. Pretty, pretty good, man. Now, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below, man. What do y'all think about this pair compared to the real pair? It's really not that bad. On feet, would somebody be able to tell? No. Let's be honest. No, no one's going to be able to tell, man. But that's all I have for this video, man. I did want to see and do a quick shout out on who won the foam runners. And as you see, man, congrats, congrats, congrats. To the winner, man. I will be going and contacting you, man. You will have 24 hours to respond. So be on the lookout for me DMing you. Congrats on those. Uh, also, I did want to include the Lost and Founds, man. When they did that last restock, they did not do an entire restock of everything they had for inventory of the Lost and Founds. So there will be another restock coming later this year. I want y'all to be ready, be prepared. I will update y'all as soon as I get the news on that. So don't worry about that. No worries, no problems. And as y'all know, man, as I always like to do, we will be giving this pair away of the Lost and Founds size eight, man. Y'all already know what to do. For this one, you must be subscribed, man. You must be subscribed and you must like this video, man. Do not forget to like the video. It really helps with the ratings and pushing the video out far, just like it did with the phone runner. So I do appreciate y'all on that, but you must be subscribed. You must like the video. And in the description down below, go ahead and put the word lost, L-O-S-T, down in the description down below, man, the word lost, and you'll be entered in to win this pair do not forget your instagram as well so subscribe like the video the word lost with your instagram in the comment section down below so i can contact you if you do win other than that man i do appreciate y'all for joining in it's always been a pleasure it's been your boy little schmack and i will catch y'all in the next one peace